and in the middle of the desert was a prison. This prison was a high security prison, but also a strange one at that. And where was I, you may be wondering? I was obviously spending my time in my little cell. In the cell, I was wondering what I could do. It was pretty confined, there wasn't too much. But then I noticed, well, the beds weren't very comfy, so I had to escape. I noticed a little vent on the ground, and I was like, hey, I probably should, you know, leave with that. I saw a couple buttons on the ceiling, pressed them, and hey, wouldn't you know it, it opened the, the little trap door. After escaping that easy place, I came to some sort of attack, played with the trap door for a little bit, and looked around. I saw a book, and, uh, well, instead of reading it, I immediately drew some water. I'm not a nerd. For some reason, um, I kept looking around in this area instead of leaving because I thought, you know, there might have been something I might be able to grab. Sadly, I wasn't able to take the shears or a sword. So, hey, I looked around and found a button underneath the cauldron. This button was not even very easy to reach, but hey, not everything is. I tried to go for the door, but I heard a piston step. Prison, I swear. Yeah, it's so weird. Why does the piston door open behind me instead of the door that's right there? Like any good escape, I needed a plan. So I decided to start planning because there was a map. I started punching it, realized you couldn't really break it or rotate it, so time to start planning. Come on. I could do this without you, right? Surely it wasn't going to be too difficult. I was in a field when, well, I had to explore it, so I went around looking, and it was confusing. It was basketball, and I don't really understand the game, and maybe I could jump up? No, I couldn't. But there's a weird arrangement of rooftops that I think I can jump over. So I give it a try, I give it a little shot, and hey, you can do it. So it is possible. I was like, I probably should do this. When I tell you, alright, when I tell you that this took, this took so long, this is editing me, right, this, this small jump, small segment, took so long to do, because I didn't know how bad I was at jumping. Turns out I'm really bad at jumping, um, was not a fun idea, uh, but hey, I just wanted to let you know that it sucked. And besides this part, every other part was incredible. That's all I wanted to say. Alright, that's all I wanted to say. And why I'm throwing bread? Alright, that's my encouraging bread. I was throwing bread because I needed to be encouraged. That is how far I fell into madness. Good. I just have a confusing sensitivity. Nice. Mmm, favorite. Okay. Would it make more sense if I did a one, two, three, and a half block jump? Or I do a three block to that? Um. I, that was it? That was all I had to do? <laughs> I'm so done. That's all I had to do. Oh my god. That's really it? That was it? That was the entire thing? Okay. In this new room, I uh, found that there were many things, so I started exploring. Like any person would do. And, uh, immediately it came to my attention that this place was going to be long. There were many things that needed to be solved. Like a coffee machine. 
in the door that I couldn't figure out where to go or where to find. Couldn't enter because I'm dumb. Try it again, and it worked. This, this equation here, confused me the most. This is so incorrect, I don't even know what to say. So there's some, a lot of codes, really well made, and I wasn't planning for this. I had to think of a way to escape faster than any man could. They said that this could take hours, and I didn't realize that before downloading this. But I was too lazy to download anything else. So I had to escape, and I had to do it fast. Oh, surely I could have made that jump. No, it was too high. Which is a little bit sad, because I really thought I could cheese my way out. But, uh, hey, what's this? I found a pearl. And a chest. Both that was very meant to be there. It had a stack of wool in it, so I decided to take my bedwars skills to the next level and start speed bridging out of the prison. Land in gracefully, of course. Never failing a jump in my life. <clears throat> Never failing a jump in my life. I continue on with guns a blazing, because I knew there was only one way to escape. I was going to throw a pearl, but I knew that it was a little bit too, well, unsafe. Threw the pearl, ran along, and made my grand escape. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. This actually uh, took a little while. Um, this took a while to make, especially because I didn't really understand how replay mod works. But uh, I really hope you enjoyed because, well, I want to do more content like this. Hopefully with less cheating um, and, you know, more actually doing it. But I wasn't expecting it and the deadline I had was a little too short. But maybe I might actually do it sometime, but properly. Um, give me some suggestions. I'm always open to it. And um, stay safe, stay healthy. And for some reason, this is my house.